Hello everyone, how you doing? Welcome to Game Tech UK. Welcome back to some more simming. So, in the last couple of days we've had Gas Station Simulator, which has absolutely blown uh, and raised the, the stakes and the bar for sim games. And then this one's come along. Now this one's called Airport Renovator. And on the 1st of October, do you remember a little while ago we had the Next Fest um, Steam demo? Well, we're going to have another um, Next Fest on the 1st of October, so there'll be lots of demos to cover. This is going to be available on the 1st, but I've got it a few days early just to show you. Um, so yeah, this, um, this is going to be a demo open to everybody on the 1st of October, along with loads of other stuff that we're going to cover as well. So I'm really looking forward to that. I really did enjoy the last Next Fest demo. We tried loads of them. Um, in fact, some of them are coming up now. Do you remember one we played called Sable? Um, I don't know if I was really taken with that one, but that one's just released in the last couple of days. Um, so yeah, some of them haven't released. What was that? Um, there was an Animal Shelter one. That That's not out. And that horror one, that isn't out yet either. But it's a good time to just try games and see what they're like. So uh, yeah, yeah, that's what we're going to be doing today. I've got no idea how long this demo is. Probably 40 minutes, something like that, I'm guessing. I don't know if it's coming to console. I don't know the release date. I have asked, but I didn't get an answer. Um, so we're just going to try it, really, in our usual Game Tech UK laid-back fashion. That's what we're going to be doing. <clears throat> Massive thank you to everyone who subscribes to the channel. We hit 35k yesterday. Um, thank you very much. I do appreciate it. Right, okay, let me say some lovely hellos, and sorry about my hot mic um, on the intro, <laughs> I was clearing my throat, <laughs> I've still got a bloody cough, still got a cough, I'm fucking falling apart, aren't I? Right, let me say some hellos, because we've got some beautiful people in the chat, who have we got? We've got Twisted Gaming, we've got the Smelly New, Pete's in here, Ravi, Random Video Channel, uh, we've got Tommy Kavanagh, Michael, Ravi's, no, Ravi's in there, Lawyer's in there, hello Tommy, Strucker's in there, Penguin of Kent, <coughs> Coffin Dodger, we've got Mad for it, we've got Tom Freer, Daniel Woodside, we've got uh, James Humble, Martin Clough, yeah, it does look interesting. The trailer looks absolutely awesome, so I'm quite excited about trying it. Yeah, that's for sure. I also saw Michael Henfrey. Are you still here, Michael? Haven't seen you for absolutely ages, mate. Um, we've got William, Christian. <coughs> Sorry about my coughing. I've done all my jobs this morning, and I went to work last night about 9 o'clock, <laughs> uh, rather than this morning. So, um, yeah, I've got all day to stream. Yeah, so we're going to have a few streams today. 
Yeah, hello, Michael. Michael, I think, is probably the first or one of the first handful of people to subscribe to the gaming channel. It's quite um, funny. We've just hit 35k. Uh, me and Michael used to subscribe to each other's channels when we did um, Model Railways. And then I did a video saying I'm thinking of starting up a gaming channel. Go and subscribe to it. And uh, yeah, so uh, how you doing, Michael? How's your railway? You still doing it? <coughs> PC gets all the best games. I wouldn't say the best games, but it gets... What the problem is, or the good thing is for developers, it's easier. It's still not easy, but it's easier for developers to develop um, within a little micro um, sort of climate of PC. You know, they can put their game on Steam, they can put their updates at any time and deal with, with uh, okay, they've still got to pay Steam, but deal with you as the customer direct. With Sony and Microsoft, there's so many hoops to jump through that I think some small developers think it's just literally not worth the time to try and um, get their game over to console. But, like, for example, if Airport Renovator um, had an update today, they could just literally push it to Steam and we would get it on our PCs instantly. Um Whereas on the console, it'd have to go through verification. You can only get so many verifications per year. You've got to sit in the queue. You've got to hope that it downloads properly. Yeah, it's it's very, very different. <coughs> Just very slowly, yeah, yeah. Yeah, mine's still up there. Mine's still up there. Yeah, mine is literally still up there. And I am planning on going back to it. Right, I will say this only once because I don't want to turn this into a, uh, a code stream. I have got a code for this demo, which I will put at the very end. I won't be mentioning it throughout the stream because I don't want I don't want it to be like the bloody bus sim stream. Um, I've got a code for the demo, so you'll be able to play exactly what I'm playing, exactly what will be available on the first, but you can play it um, at the end of the stream. So I'll just chuck a code in the chat at the end of the stream. It's not the full game. It's just the demo as I've got here. I'll put it in at the end. Right, okay, let's go. Now, the developer... <coughs> um, the developer is called Horizons, I think. Um, I've had a look, because look at the options, right? Look at the options. It looks almost exactly the same as Gas Station Simulator. It's really weird, but I've had a look. It's not the same publisher. It's not the same... Uh, maybe they're using the same sort of sim template. I don't know. Um, but this looks identical to gas station simulator but anyway let's get in uh, let's do a new game i haven't got the answer for when the game uh, full game is coming out <clears throat> okay so it looks like the way it's going to work is you're going to progress across the world um renovating all these different airports so they can easily expand expand the game can't they uh, at the moment we've just got this um one here which is uh, 50 000. so let's get in there oh that looks nice Tell me about volumes, is that all good? <coughs> Airport Renovator. Oh cool, look at that. Oh, there's our runway. So there's our... Oh, okay, it's like a little... Just a very small runway. Oh, we're jumping out! Oh, what a brilliant intro. Oh, nice one. That's really cool. That's a cool way to get into the game, isn't it? I like that. This looks nice as well. Look at that. Wow. Okay. <coughs> it's blocking New Zealand. I'm sorry, Daniel. I'm sorry. Right. Oh, okay. This is um, this is interesting. Okay. I know. There's hello, Doovy. Yeah, you're another OG Doovy. Right. Find the door to the hangar. Use the axe to destroy the padlock. That was a really, really. Um, Great intro to getting into the game. That's really cool and promising. Okay. It looks pretty nice as well, doesn't it? Wow, the bar is being raised again. <laughs> okay, so find the door to the hangar. Um, hold right to click to select axe. Okay. Um, okay. We got Are we meant to be doing that? Use the axe to destroy the padlock. That's weird. Okay, let me let me deselect it. Oh, that's better. Okay, okay. Okay, so turn the power on. 
at the fuse box. Oh, it's dark in here. It's got the same sort of yellow glow as well that um, Gas Station Simulator's got as well. But I did look. It's not the same developer or publisher. Oh, very nice. Very nice. Turn the radio receiver on. Well, apparently, without giving spoilers, I did watch the trailer, and you can get a strimmer. I mean, a strimmer! <laughs> a strimmer! To cut the grass. <laughs> Turn the radio receiver on. Where's our hint? Where's our hint? The radio receiver. What would that be? Would that be in here? Oh, yeah. We've got to clean all this up. Love it. Where would the radio receiver be? <coughs> nice, I like it. Let me turn my sensitivity down on the mice. Oh, Snowy, I got that package this morning as well. Ooh I got. I'm gonna do um, a little video about something that I've just brought. Um, not for the channel, but it'd be in this room. It's only small, but I'm so excited about it. It's crazy. Yeah, come this today. Okay, use the radio handset to call Amelia. Finally. I thought I would never hear you again. How was the landing? Hope not like the other time. <laughs> Quickly, get rid of those trees along the runway. They hinder dropping the supply crates. All right, and all they right. certainly won't make my approach to landing easier. Right, where's the runway gone? It's over here, isn't it? Yeah, this is the runway. Um, select axe. Okay. I'm like a big kid in a toy shop. I am actually, yeah, I am. But there's nothing wrong with that, is there? Um, we've got to cut these down, have we? Hello, Baz. Oh, here we go. Deforestation. So you can do little chops, or you can do a big chop. Well, it's looking promising so far. I like the idea of this. So we've got someone arriving, have we? Yeah, got a chopper out. It's, it's, it's early. You made it! Bravo! Now it's time for the first supply drop. Just hide somewhere oh, so look the at crate this, doesn't look. hit you in the head. Oh, cool. oh, they're going to drop crates. I like it. Oh, that's really good. That's quite original. It oh, shit. Oh, God. <laughs> Look out. It's fine. Oh, yes. Look at that. Now you can blow off some steam on these crates with your wow. axe. Wow. You'll like what you find inside. Okay. That's quite original, isn't it? That's this is another promising one. Wow, okay. I don't want to hit it too hard because I don't want to break what's inside. That's a really nice unique unique way of um giving us stuff to do. That's a leaf blower, isn't it? Oh, great! A blower. A blower. <coughs> that grid on the runway looks dangerous. It's the last thing I want to land on. Oh, Shane, thank you very Blow much. Away, Careful, please. the greenies might complain about you chopping down trees, yeah, and causing global warming. Not just not just adding to it, actually causing it. Thank you very much. Oh, hello. Oh my goodness, look at this. Wow, in these last two sim games, the, the ante has been upped, hasn't it? Oh, that's really good. Yeah, that is... That's fantastic. Yeah, this and gas simulator. Wow. Gas station simulator. That runway was dirty, yeah. Oh, yeah, the money's going up, yeah. 
Now, I said I wasn't going to keep saying it, but there's a few more in now, so I will just tell you. I'm, I've got a code at the end of this stream. It's not for the full game, because this isn't the full game. This demo is coming out on the next Nextfest um, Steam demo um, on the 1st of October. But at the end of the stream, I'll put a code into chat. You can put it into Steam, and you can play this early, um, just like I am. It's not the full game, okay? It's not the full game. It's just the demo, but a week early. So, yeah, I'll do that right at the end. So if you want it, get your Steam um, page open. I don't know why we're getting money for doing this. That, that in a way, doesn't make sense, but I'm not complaining. This is very satisfying. I don't think I've ever seen a blower in a game, have you? <laughs> Where'd you plug it in? Ah, it's, it's, um, you can hear it. It's petrol. Probably. Oh, I know someone else who like this. Howard will like this. <laughs> Sorry, not Howard. What am I thinking? Harold, the dirty old man. He'll love this. <laughs> it does, Jimster, but not... Um, yeah. Don't miss money you get just improving the, the value. Yeah, it might be. Oh, of course, yeah, top right, airport value. Yeah, yeah, of course, it's not money. Yeah, we're just adding to the value. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, sorry, I meant Harold, not Howard. You're probably thinking, who the bloody hell's Howard? Yeah, we've got 17 um, power extensions plugged in. Well, uh, apparently the airports get progressively bigger as well. This is like you start in airport, so I don't know exactly what we've got to do to this one. Yeah, it's the value. Yeah, yeah. It's a really, really pretty looking little game. Now, don't forget to watch the stream in 2K. I'm streaming in 2K, so if you want to see it nearer to what I'm seeing. I'm running it on 4K Ultra, exactly the same as um, gas station simulator, so it runs really well as well. It's in the Unreal Engine. <coughs> yeah, it would. It would actually, yeah. Hold it. I don't know what you think. I mean, let me know what you think in the chat, but I think this is another promising one. The ante has seemed to have been, um, you know, just moved up a little bit in these last couple of sims that we've, that we've been checking out. Probably because you haven't got a higher resolution screen. Um, but if you go to advanced, you can select it in there. Yeah, just by sweeping up, we've we've doubled the value. Use the axe. Oh, okay, we've got another one coming. Use the axe to open the airdrop box. Right, I better get out of the way because we don't want to get hit. Where is it? Where is it? I love the way this happens. That's really unique, isn't it? That's a unique way of introducing you to um, different gameplay elements and it adds to the immersion of the actual subject matter. That's very clever. Let's check what new toy is hiding in the next delivery box. Is it a woman? <laughs> <laughs> it's not. It's... Oh, it's a streamer. Oh, it's a streamer. It's a streamer, everyone. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> the grass has overgrown the entire airport, but mowing with your new grass trimmer will be a lot of fun. More grass, more fun. Exactly, I agree. I agree. Oh my goodness. Oh, stop it. Stop it. I wish we could sort of... I feel like the field of view is a little bit close to really enjoy this. I can't even see um, the top of the blades, but yeah, that's that's lovely. That's very interesting. <laughs> right, let's get this off of here. So it's sort of telling me in red, it's sort of pulsing where we need to do. Okay. 
<laughs> well, as Lil Moe Sim actually it hasn't got a streamer, has it? That's what I'm saying. It's like the last few of these, uh, at least the last couple of these um, Sim titles that we've been visiting. It's just up the bloody ante. This is uh, this is enjoyable. It's the simple things, I know. And yet, if my missus said to me, oh, can you go out in the garden? And she doesn't talk like that, but, oh, can you go out in the garden and do some streaming this afternoon? I'd be like, what? Leave off. I've got better things to do than streaming. And yet, here I am, excited with glee that I've got a digital streamer. What is wrong with me? That's a pretty good effect, though. That's done really well, isn't it? I mean, you have got to love the the Unreal Engine, just for accessibility for smaller developers to create stuff like this. I think it's fantastic. I mean, we was talking a, a couple of days ago about how maybe the Unreal Engine is creating very samey titles, which it is in a, in a way, but then all of a sudden you get this and Gas Station Simulator and, you know, I think they're fantastic. Can you not change the field of view? I don't think so. No, no. <coughs> yeah, we just love great gaming. So we've done 31%. I mean, this is going to be nice. Hopefully they let us finish. I don't know whether they would in a demo, but hopefully they let us finish this, um, this smaller airport. Yeah, they have block. I mean, this has got elements of, like, lawnmower sim in it now. But not only that, they're not only doing that. If we talk about the last two sims, so this one and Gas Station, they're not only taking ideas, though, but they are... they seem to be implementing it in a sort of very fresh manner. You know, like the, the airdrops and all that. And this is quite a good representation of a streamer. I mean, I don't know how hard it would be to implement a streamer in a game, but I feel that... This is actually a really good implementation of a of a streamer. Oh, thank you, Shane. Yeah, I love streaming in 2K. It's becoming more... Um, you know, uh, standard. A lot of people are now starting to stream in 2K, and it will become the standard eventually. But uh, yeah, I've got the internet, so why not use it? <laughs> yeah, just wait till your cord runs out. Yeah, those rocks would mess you up, yeah. No, I did ask them for a release game, and I asked them if it was coming to console, but they just said, we'll let you know. They're a Polish developer, um, and they was kind enough to let me show you this demo early, because it is coming, there's another Next Fest. You know, a little while ago, we, we looked at a lot of um, demos, and I'll be doing exactly the same thing again. Um, all the Next Fest demos, um, 1st of October, that'll be. Um, and this is going to be available for everyone, so if you've got a PC, you can try it, see if, you, see if your PC runs it, all good. They've just been lovely enough to let me show you a couple of days early. And I've also got a code, a code for you at the end of the stream, for you to try the demo early as well. I know, Jamie, but, uh, yeah, it's, uh... It's pretty good. I think there is a supermarket sim, both in terms of management and stacking shelves. Yeah, there's trader sim, which I didn't really fancy, but yeah, there is trader sim where you buy stuff and sell it. There's also another one which I've been meaning to uh, bring to you, toy repair simulator, where you pick up old toys, you sand them, you paint them. I mean, I don't know. They're good games, aren't they? It's a good genre, this sort of... Uh, you know, fix them up genre, I suppose. It, it's good. I think it's great. So we're on 66%. 66%, Sonny. No, I'm not getting probed live on air, Michael.
Well, they've got Boyfriend Simulator, Jamie. Yeah. They've got Dungeon Simulator. Right, we're only on 74%, so let's, uh, let's crack on. So a couple of streams today at least. Although I have got this little thing I want to make a video on. Do I do that today or do I wait for next week to do that? <coughs> Hello DXG, how are you? There you go, look at our value going up, this is cool. Funnily enough, I got recommended a little while ago on YouTube um, a, a video by someone in America who's um, done something, something similar to what we're doing now, but not an airport, an old racetrack. It's only like an old oval. Uh, you might have been recommended, it seems to be doing well. Um, yeah, it's quite interesting, he's brought this um, old racetrack and it looks like it's all overgrown and he's he's discovered all the track underneath it. It's really cool. It's like a large oval. I think mainly made for carts, but uh, yes, I'm following him now. It's quite interesting. <coughs> you saw it as well? Yeah, I think he's he might have paid a bit of money to have it recommended out. But uh, yeah, it's quite cool, isn't it? And he's just discovered another track just up on the same bit of land um, under a pond or something, under like a lake. Does Kaz approve of this? Yeah. Hello, ACS. How are you? Right, 98, 99. 100%. Well, we do the job properly, so it might stay 100%. What are they calling the terminal? That little building? Wow. Yeah, they are, yeah, okay. There is actually um, a, a, a uh, you know, like, um, uh, you know, like a, um, uh, Stephen R., thank you very much, let me read that. I can't see it there. Never underestimate the importance of nicely trimmed landing strip. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, Stephen. Oh, you're a lovely geezer, and I appreciate that. Thank you. And now you've just put that image in my mind. <laughs> you know, like um, what am I, you know, like the isometric sort of management sims, where you you know, you, a bit like a uh, retro arcade simulator. Do you remember? You know, you remember I played on the channel Arcade Sim. There is actually a game developer sim where you open up your studio. I can show you that if you want. I got sent the key ages ago. You don't develop games, but you. Um, it's only a little indie. I think it's a one-man, um, one-man developed game, where you set aside time for your budget, your 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 bug fixing, your development. Yeah, it could be quite interesting. I've got a shitload of games to bring you. Absolute shitload. But it's not a bad thing, is it? That's a good thing. Yeah, I'm looking forward to the 1st of October because I can show you loads of demos on Steam again because I enjoyed that last time. <laughs> yeah, definitely snowy. Also, I think I've worked out what the problem is with my arm. I think I've got a repetitive strain injury, you know? from sitting here um, with my the way I'm sitting yeah I think I, I was looking into it last night and I sat down here and I thought yeah as soon as I put my left hand there and there's a thing called uh, like like tennis elbow there's a thing called mouse, mouse arm uh, which is I think what I've got and I don't really know what to do about that but yeah I think I've definitely got it's not it is a, supposedly a trapped nerve in a way isn't it but I don't think anything's happened I think I've just got repetitive strain injury which can be an issue. No, not the right wrist. The left wrist. Right, let me just finish here. I'll keep sitting here going, fucking hell. Holding me my hand up. Hey, here we go. Here we go. What we got? What we got? There it is. I love this little bit. This is cool. Right, 
What's Voltaren? Time to open this new box quickly. I'm curious what's inside. Amelia is curious. Awesome. Right, let's um. Yeah, it would actually, Dale. Yeah. What is that? Oh my god, is that a jet wash? Is that a jet wash? What are these doing us? Get a cat to cure my some, yeah. I'm like, oh, have you got a cure? Oh, no, no. <coughs> a wanker's wrist. Here we go. Okay. Pressure washer. 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 Oh wow. my god! Excellent. <laughs> this terrace is reminiscent of a previous era. Yeah, you it's not really in well. but I have taken my wedding ring off because it does feel like a little bit tight there. But I sort it out. I'm like a fucking pain in the ass, don't I? Always something wrong with me recently, isn't there? Right. Okay. Here we go. What are we doing? Wash patio floor. A uh, floor. Wash outside walls. Okay. Let's uh, let's close that. Oh my god, it's changing colour as well. I like that. Can we do anything with this rubbish? Can we do anything? Uh, no, it seems not. Okay. Get some physio exercises, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to have to do something because yesterday it was really hurt after the streams yesterday. Totally numb. What is that program that you can use with Steam? What program? Oh, this is this is right up my alley. Yes, yeah, turned into jet wash sim now. Oh, use the axe to destroy trash. Yeah, sorry, I didn't read it, did I? Yeah, donut. <coughs> I'd rather pick that up, wouldn't you? Like, gas simulator. I mean, it's just... You, you're creating more mess, mate. Did you like train station renovation? Yeah, there's loads of that on the channel. This is all very intuitive as well. It's all, um... Like gas station. It's not trying to... It's not clunky. It works well. I think that pulsing needs to go and maybe like gas station, gas station simulator have that on a button so if I want a hint have it on a button because I don't need that pulsing all the time I've, I've given the I've been given the job I'm quite capable of doing it I think that pulsing should be there on a on a, a key if I want to ask because it's quite off-putting and a little bit ruining the immersion with like a weird pulsing um all the way around all the time but that's just an opinion There you go, that looks nice. Let's do the other bit. Daisy, no, no. It's about the same quality as Power Wash Simulator, isn't it? I wish we had some water running down um, the walls, but that's probably too much to ask especially as the main sort of focus isn't jet washing is it it's just something in the game there you go 49 percent <coughs> oh it'd be crazy shane wouldn't it maybe it is in there maybe it is maybe we just haven't got to it yet it's quite a hefty demo they're giving you aren't they so this is going to be available in, in a demo form. I don't know when it's coming out, but it's going to be on the demo on Steam um, on the 1st of October. So you can try it for yourself then. Seventy-four percent, so we've just got the back to do now. <coughs> <coughs> Hit Dennis with it, yeah. Bloody Dennis, he's getting on my nerves. Uh, 
Hash drivers remain unchanged. Oh god. Well, I suppose it's good that Mick isn't out of a seat, but he really needs a better seat than that, but I can't believe that they're keeping them together. They're always rowing. They don't like each other. Their performance is terrible. The whole team is terrible, but at least Mick's in a seat still, isn't it, I suppose? Right, 98. Oh, we've got a little bit to find. See, now I want the, to press the uh, pulsing thing to see where, where I've missed, you know? It'd be the, the uh, stairs. Yeah, this would be it. Obviously missing a tinsy little bit. Oh, it might be this. Yeah, oh yeah, it's the wood, yeah. <coughs> Hello, Beard, how are you? Yeah, definitely Beard, but I'll tell you what, this has got potential as well. This this isn't on a... Um, it's not like it's on an entirely different level and you're thinking, oh, it's just not as good. No, this is this has got potential too. But yeah, Gas Station is... Uh, is great. Big favourite of mine. I might even play it after this if me arm holds up. You played any lawnmower? Yeah, it's on the channel. Hello, Daniel. Oh, we got all this wood to do. That's why we've missed it. Yeah, it's a little bit weird, um, but... We can, we can try it, can't we, Matt? Because there's a progression tree in um, Gas Station Simulator, I think that's what the addictive bit is. I want to do the upgrades, I want to progress it, I want to get to this level, that level, I want to get it all open. So, yeah, there's a nice um, addictive quality to that. Right, 100%, use the axe to destroy rubbish, not a problem, let's get indoors and do it. No, we've got the 100% now, so we're happy with that. Not entirely convinced about the way they're getting rid, rid of rubbish, I'd much rather have a skip outside, um, pick it up, put it in there, maybe a little bit more grindy, but a bit more real than just, how do we get rid of the rubbish? Oh, I don't know, should we just hit it with an axe? Um, that's where you see gas station simulators just up up the ante just a little bit and made it feel a little bit more realistic. Hitting rubbish with an axe mm, is not it's not the best thing, is it? And we might need some of that. <coughs> yeah, it is uh, Michael. Have you tried it? Okay, we've done it. One more thing. I forgot about something. Oh, we got another it's getting drop. dark. There's a storm coming. I'm dropping the last supply crate. I love this. This is brilliant. This is very, very cool. Yeah, love the way they thought of that. There's a lot of anties being up, yeah. Oh, thank you, Mink. Uh, congratulations on 35k, you're one of the top blokes around. Thanks for all the entertainment. Thank you, Mick. Thank you. I appreciate that. A member for tw 25 months. Bloody hell. Thank you. That is, uh, that's awesome. Thank you very, very much. I think that's a new thing that YouTube is doing, showing people how long, um, yeah, that's really good. I like that. I like that. Because then I can say thank you. 25 months. Bloody hell. Oh, what's this? I think it is a woman in a cake. That They know what I like. Yeah, it'd be a generator, wouldn't it? Lights and lamps. If you want me to land safely, you need to illuminate the runway. Ah, place Quick. edge lights. I don't nice. want to fly at night during a storm. Uh, furniture airstrip lights. Yeah, this is cool. Okay. Oh, nice. I mean, aren't they supposed to be a certain color? 
for runways. I mean, I'm guessing red. I don't know. Um, yeah. Uncle's up, it, <laughs> up in the aunties. <laughs> what colour? What about green? I'll do green. Yeah, I'll do green. Not sure what colour they're meant to be. A DS any time? Yeah, hopefully it'll be available Friday morning, in which case I'll do some then. <laughs> Wait, I'll Google it. Oh, they're white, are they? Okay, not. I want, are they white? How are you, Scarab? Yeah, no, if they're meant to be white, we'll do it white. Oh, green and blue for taxi, and. Oh, God. Oh, white runway lights, green and blue for taxi. Okay, that's fine. Well, we'll put them white. It would definitely be interesting to see how um, varied the airports are. This is obviously a tiny little small thing. Hopefully, you get a large airport. And red for no entry. Okay, I gotcha. Yeah, hopefully um, Death Stranding will be available Friday morning. That will be perfect, um, Death Stranding. Oh, James, you're going to love it. I hope that a lot of people get into it the second time around. Forget all the negativity from, oh, it's just a delivery sim from people that haven't played it and just watched a YouTube video of it. It's brilliant. It's absolutely brilliant. I love Death Stranding. It is one of my favourite games. 28? Where's the other one then? Oh, look at this. That looks fantastic, doesn't it? <coughs> yeah, if you've already got um, Death Stranding, the upgrade's five quid. So, I mean, if you haven't already got it, and you want it to be a little bit naughty, you could um, you could buy it second hand, really cheap, and then just pay the five pound upgrade. You still don't get it. <laughs> oh, now the lights have gone out. Oh, check the fuse box. Okay, okay. You had your jab yesterday, so you can't do much. Yeah, you still can do much, can't you? You can just carry on as normal. Solve the power. Let's go and turn the radio back on. <laughs> no alien bus party, no boy. Right, there's that. I know that everyone needs some privacy from time to time, but I must admit I was a bit worried. I'm about to land. See you soon. Good job. This might be the end of the demo. It might be. Yeah, I think it will be. But very, very promising and, and good as a um, good as a demo. That really showed me what the game's about. Yeah, I completed it, but I didn't do it how the game wanted me to do it. The game wanted me to set up loads of structures. I just wanted to walk around, so I'll probably do that again. So I didn't get the um, platinum, but I did complete it. Crazy story. Yeah, this is very good. Don't forget, I've got a code to put in um, so you can play this demo early. So if you want to get your Steam client open, it's not the full game, it's the demo exactly as the same as, as I've got here, um, which will be widely available on the 1st of October. But if you want to play it now, it's all good. <coughs> and there they are coming at the land. Yeah, they're very, very interesting very interesting and it's 100% wanted me leaving more 100% yeah awesome right I'm going to put that code in the chat and then we'll come back with some gas station simulator if you're up for that so here is the code in the chat it's not the full game it is just the demo um, it's just the demo 
but yeah, you don't have to say thank you or anything. It's there, you know, go and install it if you want to install it. If not, you can wait until um, the 1st of October. But yeah, yeah, that was really cool. Definitely want more of that, and it is one that I will be getting 100%. Right, that is it. I'll be back very, very soon with some more. See you later, everyone. And if you're not coming in for the uh, gas station simulator, see you next time.